And who will ever forget bassist Joe Osborne, who, as a member of the infamous Wrecking Crew in Los Angeles, played on countless hits by The Carpenters, The Association, Johnny Rivers, and so many others. When I think of Joe Osborne, I instantly go to The Carpenters. I remember as a child listening to that stuff, and again, the bass would catch my attention uh, just because of the lines that he would play that were so melodic along with Karen's vocal lines. Uh, I didn't know who he was at the time. I, I've never been one to know who's who very well. But the stuff that you find yourself just whistling or humming when you're going down the road, there's a good chance he played bass on it. From the, from the 60s on through. And then making the move to Nashville in the early 70s. You know, after he had the huge success in LA and all that stuff, then to Nashville, it was huge. You know, the guy was playing on everybody's stuff. I snuck around and listened to uh, the Delta radio stations on PBS. And I remember hearing Memphis for the first time on PBS, one of the stations, local stations, you know, and, and just listening to the a little chugging of that beat, that rhythm, you know, <clears throat> and uh, just all the parts together made something very simple but very musical and impacted the 12, 13 year old boy. So I learned to play a lot of the uh, classics that way. Give me Memphis, Tennessee Help me find the party Trying to get in touch with me You would not leave a number But I know the place to call Cause my uncle took the message And he wrote it on the wall Help me information To get in touch with my Marie She's the only Please try to put me through to her in the Memphis, Tennessee. 